Okay guys, so what I'm going to be doing first is I'm going to start off with this um, eyeshadow primer and it's by Hard Candy. Uh, it's called Eyes the Limit. I picked this up at Walmart. It was $5 and it's actually a new product. So I'm just going to apply this on my lid, well all over my lid actually. And as you can see, it's like a tinted brown color, but um, there is no problems with it, even when I blend it into my skin. So I'm just going to spread that all over my eye, and I'm just going to allow that to set. And I'm going to go in next with my um, e.l.f. Uh, Tone Correcting Concealer. This is in the color Honey. I'm just going to put this... Um, under my eye, down my nose, and also um, just on my cupid's bow as well. So now I'm going to go in with this uh, Coastal Sense concealer brush, and I'm going to use this to blend out all the concealer that I just put on my face. to get under the eye really well and make sure it's right underneath the lash line at the bottom there so moving on now I'm just going to set my concealer and I'm actually using the elf mineral boost in corrective yellow So for the eyes today, I'm going to be using the BH Cosmetics uh, Party Girl Palette. And this is it right here. It's a 40 color eyeshadow palette. I'm going to use the eyeshadow brush. This is the first eyeshadow brush here. And I'm going to go into this blue color right here. And I'm going to put that right onto my lip. Now, uh, once you're done putting that color onto your lid, I'm just going to go over it with a brighter blue color, and that is this color right here on the very corner, and I'm going to pack that right over that lighter blue color that I already put on my lid. Now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to go in with the blending brush from Coastal Scents. Here it is right here. It's just a nice short bristled blending brush and I'm going to use this brown colored, it's kind of coppery actually, um, this brown coppery color right here and I'm going to put that into my uh, crease and also up above the brow area. So next up what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my Sonia Cash crease brush and I'm going to go into this uh, black color here and I'm just going to pick it up very lightly onto the brush and um, darken my outer V with that color there. And as you can see I'm just taking my time building up the color because I don't want it to be too dark. Now guys, what I'm going to do is go back in with that Coastal Sense blending brush and blend that black right in. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use my e.l.f. shadow brush and I'm going to apply my highlight color and that's going to be this nice beige color on the corner here. I'm going to wipe off that uh, blending brush and I'm going to go back in and blend that highlight color out underneath my brow bone. So the next step after that guys is I'm going to use my Black is Black 24 hour L'Oreal Gel Liner and I'm going to line my eyes and I'm going to wing it out at the top and I'm going to use the Coastal Scents detailer brush here to do that liner on the top of my eye. Now to actually do the wing, I'm going to use my 
NYC liquid liner and it is just in the color black. Here it is here and I'm just going to use that to do the wing on the outer corner. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my detailer brush here. This is not from the Coastal Scents brush set that I am reviewing or demoing today, but I'm going to use the color that I put up on my brow bone here and I'm just going to go into my inner corners with that same color just to brighten up the eye a bit. Now guys, I'm also going to take that color that I put up on my brow bone and in my inner tear corner here and I'm going to go right underneath that top wing liner that I had just created. Okay, now I'm going to go back in with the NYC liquid liner again and I'm just going to go and do my bottom wing. So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with a black eyeliner coal here and I'm just going to line my bottom lash line here. And now after that guys I'm just going to go in with my mascara and it's the Extra Super Lash by Rimmel London. I'm just going to do both my top and bottom lashes. So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with the powder brush from Coastal Scents in the collection that I am demoing and I'm going to use my uh, powder here and I'm going to set my face. I had previously applied foundation if you are wondering. So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with this e.l.f. brush again, the same one that I used for my highlight setting and I'm just going to rub it off. Make sure to get off any excess product and I'm going to go in with my Fit Me uh, foundation. It's a powder foundation and it's in the color 360 Mocha and I use this contour. And I'm just going to contour my cheeks and um, up on the forehead a little bit as well. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. Uh, brush. This is a separate brush from the one that I used earlier and I'm going to go in with that same contouring powder and just go down the sides of my nose. So the next step here is I'm going to go in with this e.l.f. It's actually a blush but it's actually too light for me and it's in the color Peachy Cheeky. So I use it for just putting on a little bit of a highlight. So I'm going to go um, on the top of my cheekbone and I'm also going to go down my nose and my cupid's bow. And this is the brush here by the way. And the last step to this look guys is of course a lip look. And what I'm going to be using is this dark uh, brown lip liner and I believe it's Cover Girl and it's in the color Coffee. So here it is right here. And of course guys I'm going to be using a nice nude looking lipstick to go with this lip pencil and the color I'm going to be using is the Wet n Wild color in 902C and that's Bare It All. There's the color, well the labeling, and here's the actual color of the lipstick. And here's the finished look guys. <laughs> 